And this is the astrological forecast for the sign of cancer for April 2018, brought to you by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading website for tarot readers, psychics, mystics and channelers. Cancer, it's all happening in signs opposite or square to you. So I'm afraid the theme of this year so far does seem to be continuing in the short term, as in you're the whipping boy. Everyone seems to be blaming you for what's going on in their life. Now, on the one hand, you've got big shoulders. You can take it and don't take it personally because other people are actually seeing you as strong enough to take their nonsense, which is actually a kind of inverse compliment. Secondly, what's going on is actually nothing to do with you. It's other people's stuff, but they're, they're using you as a dumping ground. If you realise this, you're not going to take it personally and you're not going to get too affected. At the same time, there's a Mercury retrograde happening in the sign of Aries, a sign that um, you're, not that com you're not that comfortable with. And I do think that in certain areas of your life, particularly that around career, job, work, goals, ambition, this is not a time to be making major changes, okay? You're going to find that there's going to be disagreements or arguments or just differences of opinion or that there'll be communication breakdowns, that people will look at you with vacant eyes and they will hear you, but they're not listening. So there's no point in trying to get your opinion out there or trying to make big changes in the short term. In the second half of May, from Monday the 16th onwards, when Mercury stopped going uh, retrograde, yes, things will pick up. But even so, with so many planets in your opposite sign of Capricorn this month, this is a time for staying low underneath a radar screen and not coming out fighting. Bide your time. It will be all right come May. As far as April 2018 goes, Cancer, have a quiet and somewhat uh, behind-the-scenes month. <laughs>